Arda Turan is the person that recommended I come and play in La Liga. I used to speak to him and he would always say that I had to come and play here in Spain. Three or four years ago I had an opportunity to come but I turned it down and he always insisted that I had to sign for a La Liga team. I already knew that this was a league with a high level and with great clubs. It's a league with a lot of quality that always has teams in the final stages of the Champions League. I knew that being here, I was going to face the best teams. And to show my quality and keep growing, it was clear that coming here was a great option. The competition in Spain is much tougher than in any other league that I've played in. So for me, this was a jump that I had to adapt to as quickly as possible. For me to come here and play against Barca and also against Sada Turan was the best. It was an unforgettable game for me to face him. If we compare the fans, of course Galatasaray have a very passionate fan base that supports the club a lot. But Deportivo also have incredible fans. We didn't give them much joy this year, but there are always at least 25,000 people in the stadium who have come to cheer us on week in, week out. Although, obviously, Galatasaray fans are more hot-tempered than Depo fans. The people here always support me, both when I play and also when I don't. I'm very grateful for that. That's why I try to give everything for the team on the pitch. I feel that they love me very much and I really appreciate it. Derbies are always very important. Before I came here, more than the matches against Barca or Real Madrid, the one I thought about was the game against Celta. I had a lot of desire to play that fixture. But in the end, I didn't play in one, and in the other, I came on as a substitute. The worst thing for me this season has been not being able to play more in those derbies. He really likes talking to the players. Since his arrival, we've been able to get the points that we needed for safety. He's a good coach, but the previous manager, Gais Garitano, was also a good manager. With him, we played well, but we weren't very lucky and the results didn't come. I think that overall, if we look at the entire season and if we look at our performances, we deserve to be higher up the La Liga table. Joselu and I get along very well. 
We share a room on away trips, and he always tries to teach me how to speak Spanish. I think he had the same difficulties I have when he was at clubs in England or Germany. That's why he knows very well how you feel, and he always tries to help me out. We get along very well. I've scored three goals. For the first one, I had an assist from Juan Fran. <laughs> At Eibar, it was Carlos Gil. I don't remember if I'd scored a header before. I don't even remember connecting many headers. I think that maybe it was my first headed goal of my entire career. The goal against Athletic was spectacular, but the most important was against Valencia. It was my first goal for Deportivo at Riazor and also my first headed goal. I also missed a clear chance from a header in the match against Valencia. Yes, also with my head. On a personal level, it's been a very good season for me. Before I came here, I was worried about the adaptation process and difficulties with the language. But I've overcome everything very well. I've played more than I thought I would, and I can say that it's been a good season for me. Although, of course, on a collective note, I would like the team to have been higher up in La Liga. But I can say I'm quite satisfied.